One of the most important things in life is always to make your guests feel welcome. I have someone coming over for a drink in 30 minutes and I want to make sure that they feel that I'm anticipating their arrival. Because if you think about it, how many times have you gone to someone's home before, you've knocked on the door, it took far too long for them to answer the door, they answer the door, there are more ingredients on the apron than made it into the salad dressing. Then you walk into the kitchen and there's a dinner in various states of preparation. You look at the dining room table, it hasn't been set yet. You almost feel like you're imposing. The most important thing to make your guests feel valued is to make them feel welcome. So it's less than 30 minutes and appealing to my tried and trusted approach to creating good experiences, I want to appeal to all the senses, what you smell, touch, taste, see and hear, and do it super quickly. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to start off by opening a bottle of wine so it can decant and it can breathe. I don't plan to make a big dinner, so it's going to be chips and dip, but it's the best chips and it's the best dip. And then I'll light some candles and I'll get us in the mood. I really love, I found this amazing, amazing. This is the new rabbit. Check this out. It's pretty cool. It's such a cool way to open a bottle of wine. What I do is this. How cool is that? That's the James Bond of opening wine. Doesn't matter if it's a $20 bottle of wine or a $200 bottle of wine. I love the idea of decanting a bottle of wine. It just makes for a better experience. When you think about it in life today, the most important idea is all about creating experience. Everyone's looking for an experience. How do we take our guests on a journey? Our red wine can breathe. And now, I love kettle chips. These baked ones are super healthy too. Store-bought sauce, it's really good. I love incense. Actually a cigar holder that I use to keep my incense nice and fresh. Get it around. Then I'm going to light some candles and put in some music. So that's some incense. Now, I've been in these clothes all day long. I still don't have time for a shower and a shave, but at least I can go and put in a clean shirt, splash some water in my face, brush my teeth, and I'll be guest ready. I'll be right back. It's amazing what some mouthwash, a toothbrush, and a fresh shirt can do. So what I want to do, light a few candles now, set some things in my living room, and I'll be good to go. You know, it's interesting, even if I don't have fresh flowers in my house, I love working with candles. Because when you think about it, there's no such thing as too many candles. They always make us look younger, more glamorous. They look, make us look like we just came back from somewhere really fabulous. Or it helps you make that great transition from daytime to nighttime. So I'm leaving the day behind and welcoming the night. Let's bring some food in. There we go. Well, I feel like a new man. My home is ready to receive a guest. And make sure you hit that subscribe button and join us next week for another episode of Life As It Should Be. Actually, it's not a guest, it's a date. Time you left. I mean, you've got to go now. The date's coming. Thank you.